Welcome back everybody. It's me Lamont Life Gains Channel. Thought I'd give you guys a quick video. Um, still adorn the goals challenge. It is today is March 27th. We go back to weigh in April 10th. I've lost about 45 pounds and trying to get to 50 so all my abs can be seen and making this thing happen trying to be an inspiration for you guys out there but before we jump into that i want to talk about something that's been circulating around the web and you know if you've ever been a heavy person you typically kind of wonder about loose skin and so there's this kid named matt diaz he got a lot of loose skin um i got the video that's going to be on the end of this you guys take a look at it for yourself i commend him for actually being brave enough and emotional enough to get up there and talk about um, losing weight the right way, so to speak. And now he's concerned about his image with his skin. And just wanna give you guys tips on what you can do with loose skin. You know, I was 305 and right now I'm down to 187. And I worried about that through my process as well. But the one thing I can tell you guys that you have to do, you just gotta keep cutting. No ifs, ands, or buts. Everybody's body is different. Everybody's going to be of different ages. So the older you are, the tougher it's going to be. But your skin is a cell. It's elastic. It's, as much as it'll stretch, it'll come back if you cut. Now, there are some situations where it is real extreme, but usually the reason why your skin kind of sags is because you're losing weight pretty fast. Um, and you also want to make sure when you're losing weight that you are hitting the weights. That's one way to make sure that some of that space that you're going to be losing density from has a place for something to grow, which would be muscles. So, you know, don't let that bother you from losing weight. At the very least, make sure you're treating the skin like it's an organ. You want to treat it from the inside and the out. Me personally, I took something called ZMA, um, zinc, uh, B6. Um, and I use coconut oil on areas that I felt like was going to be kind of loose. And to this point, it's all healing just fine. You know, when you get involved with weight loss, it's a sustainable thing that you're trying to do. So when you start the journey, don't let loose skin worry you. I've seen people, I've seen some women that have had like twins. Stomach went back the way it was. It might have a stretch mark or two but the skin's pretty okay. So guys, don't let that hinder you from your weight loss goals. And again, I commend this Matt Diaz kid. It was real brave for him to get on the web and show that. But guys, you just have to keep cutting most of the time. You gotta keep cutting. A lot of that stuff that you see hanging is still fat. So just stay on your journey, stay vigilant, and keep cutting. And guys, I'm gonna let you guys see what my man Matt did. You know, um, commend him for his bravery and that long journey 270 pounds so uh don't forget to like the video comment subscribe go out there and get yourself a life hi um my name is matt diaz um i lost 270 pounds in the last six years when i was 16 years old i weighed about 495 pounds in my heaviest weight i'm a big advocate for body positivity um but I've never shown what my excess skin really looks like. And I think it's important that I do because I want to be open with you people about who I am and what my body's like. Um, I've never done this before, <laughs> ever. But I'm really, really scared. So just don't, like, you know, don't judge too much, I guess. Um, so, this is what 270 pounds worth of excess skin looks like, essentially. It's on my arms, my torso, um, and there's nothing I can do about it. I have a birthmark here. I was born with it. I've never shown anyone. Um, but all of this is just excess skin from the weight loss. And I work out, and I work really hard, and there's just nothing I can do about it. Um, and I'm, I'm really scared to put this up. Because I'm I'm scared. People won't think I'm attractive anymore. I'm scared um all the nice messages will stop. And 